So he's going airmail on this shot. Jake Corley. We are underway. These bags are about to be live here in a second. <laughs> Redden first shot off to the side, throwing the zero gravity. It looks like Neptunes, I believe. Rough start here. Mm -hmm. Jay's got a lane. Nice lane. And he's going to hit it. Good job collecting. Flip that one over. Went slick side at it. Minimize some of the damage. In for four. Good start for Jay. Championship match underway over there on... Court number one, Philip Lopez Jr. and Alex Rawls doing battle versus Matt Corley and Eddie Grindersleeve. Matt and Eddie have to pull off the double dip. Winner of this match here gets to the king seat, by which belongs to Jareth Nichols and Ian Cripps. 4 nothing. quick start for Jay and Tanner. Here my so pick. we're one game behind? We are one game behind. Okay. Championship match more likely will be played on this court. That's because you missed that up. That's your, that's <laughs> yeah. your karma. I missed that up. Got to take the tear down. Mm -hmm. Oh, no. That's unlucky. Hits the bag hard. Hits his bags in, and his bag goes over the hole. Uh, bracket's not working. Can I give a recap? Eek. I don't know if it'll let me paste this or not. I'll try. All right, they might have gave me permission to paste. It looks like the brackets right there. Now, if I get banned, though, it's your fault. I get banned for my own live stream. Well, that's definitely going. Just got to tap it. That's a hard tap. <laughs> so that, was, that was unnecessary, but it worked great. He tried to grab that bag on the left. At least he didn't sacrifice his bag to do so. Joe with first shot. Nice level one blocker. Tanner comes in right behind it. Not the airmail you want. So you got a Corley on each court, huh? Yep. Are they related? There's a roll. I mean, that was going. <laughs> that was going either way. Tanner's bag does move closer to the hole. That's kind of what he wanted to do on that shot. Another roll. Joe with a nice roll shot over the top. Tanner went for the push, takes in two. I think we're tied now. He's not mad at it, but it's not what he was trying to do. They're brothers? Okay. Cameron Corley in the chat. What's up? Another Corley. Corley's all over the place all of a sudden. Thompson's and Corley's today. <laughs> what it's about. This is no relation. It's all right. What's up, Cameron? She has no relation is what you're saying? Or he? Uh, Yeah, no relation for Cameron Corley. I think it's a he. I can't really see the picture. Alyssa Nicole Neistat says, go, Joe. That's a good bag. Tapped his bag on the left side and hung out right in front of the hole. Kind of forcing Jay to have to take them all. Oh, 
Joe just going right down the middle with his first shot. Hmm. Tanner's not as clean. Mm -mm. Speaking of not clean, Joe with that miss, give it right back to Tanner. And a 10 on 10 wash. Missed opportunity for both players there. Come back down now, right hand side, Brevin with first shot. Eight to six. And he's off to the side. Hmm. Being left handed shot. Not sure you can come across the board and collect that, but the yeah, zero gravity bags are. Now they're very Jay, grippy. Jay could help him. That one might be a little bit too far for Jay to collect later on. Going for the hard push. Stayed drops, sticky side with yeah, it. Drops one, hangs out. Uh, it's still hanging there. Hasn't fallen yet. Oh, it didn't fall? Not yet. So it looked like it from where I'm sitting. He wants to block? Is that what he said? No, he wants to push. Now it fell. Definitely fell. Hmm. Wants him to take them all. It's kind of an awkward angle, though. What a shot. Insane. First of all, I thought the call by Tanner was wrong. And then the execution from Jay just proved it right. I didn't see that happening at all. I did, th I did think that was a tricky call. I was a, a cringing a little bit, like, ooh, I don't know if that's going to work. I stand corrected, though. What a shot. But he nailed it. First shot from Tanner down the middle in the hole already. Wow. Fantastic bag to hit those bags in and stay right there in front of the hole. Well, halfway in the hole. And a nice cleanup. Some good rounds that we're seeing right now. Yeah, now we're getting into it. Oh, just enough social. Now, where did you come up with this social thing? Uh, I think it started with four, fireball four baggers. We're gonna do a four bagger and a shot of fire. Or, sorry, a shot of fireball for every time there's a four bagger, and then we realize that's a lot of alcohol. Mm -hmm. So then we just start taking sips. And uh, there's a card game. We play Circle of Death. And you get a certain card. Everyone has to take a drink. So. But why did you call it social? This is social social atmosphere. Everyone, everyone in your social circle has to drink. Okay. Must be a Midwest thing. Definitely. On the social medias too, you know, people back home can participate if they like to. I feel like a lot of people do participate back home. If they do, they're getting drunk. Let's go. <laughs> when can we watch the doubles championship? 7 p.m. Oh, no. The first one is Super Hole at 7 p.m. Eastern. I would imagine it's right after, but let me double check. Joe off to the side. Tanner going up. He hits his bag in, rimmed out. Joe brings it a little bit closer. Here it is. Okay, the Super Bowl is at 7 p.m. Eastern on ESPN2. And then the doubles finals and singles finals is at 8 p.m. Eastern, ESPN2. There you go. Oh, man. Bunched on him. Tanner's going to get away with two points. There you go, Lee. Nathan says, my TV says 11 p.m. Where are you at? You in Canada? Canada. Are you looking at ESPN too? That's what it says on here. Oh, 
And then they could be replaying it, maybe, at that time. I'm not sure. I guess I could look on mine. I'll give you a rundown of what happened, though. No, don't you One dare. One person threw a bag and hole. The other person on the other team threw a bag and hole. A lot of times, and then one team got to the 21. Wow. You are all caught up. Riveting. That's probably why they don't want me on ESPN yet. That would be my commentary. Yeah, no, that wouldn't fly. <laughs> that definitely would not fly. Stand back, Jeff. I got this. Yeah. Tap me in. 14-8, to eight, seven points away. Getting to the championship match. Jareth and Ian won the first battle, 22 to 4. Ian and uh, Jareth have been sitting for quite a while, though. You're right. It shows that at 10 p.m. on my phone as well. Where are we at now? Are we in Eastern? Yeah, we're in Eastern time zone. So that's weird. Joe's already got one off the back of the board. I think you, I think this the play right here is go in, do some damage control. I wouldn't even go after this one. He's taking a step out. Does it? That's nice collect. Great collect. Why are you even doubting yourself, Joe? That was a good shot. Yeah, so it shows uh, uh, 10 o'clock on my phone. Um, so, yeah, that's a little bit confusing now. Nathan says probably because the NCAA tournaments might be on. They mm -hmm. are. Maybe. I just don't know why they told us that time then. That's the weird part. Yeah, it's basketball. So 10 and 11 p.m. Eastern is when it's showing up on uh, mine. There you go, chat. You know what? So hopefully you're not confused. Seven. So it's 7 p.m. Pacific. 7 p.m. Pacific is 10 p.m. Eastern. So I wonder if the times on that graphic are just in the wrong time zone. Because it's 7 and 8 Pacific Standard Time. No clue. I don't think I've ever been on Pacific time. Arizona's new, Arizona's mountain time, right? Yes, except they don't do daylight savings, so there is a period of time when we're on the same one. Ooh, that bag comes up short. Realize the score is 19 to 8 already. Yeah, running away with it. Over on court number one, Matt and Eddie are tied 9 9. And it's still game number one. Who has to be double dipped? Over there? Yeah. Uh, Philip and Alex. Okay. Good finish. Social. Double four bagger. Awkward knuckles to boot. Let's go. It's a great. It's a great match. It's got everything. Or a great round, I should say. Oh, 
Hmm. Oh, almost came across and got it. Extra little bumper for uh, Joe there. Interesting. Oh, yeah, go with that. <laughs> He's like, sure, do whatever you want to do. <laughs> it's funny. Like, oh, yeah, okay, yeah, sure. All right, so he's got a decision made. I don't think anybody except for Tanner knows what it is. <laughs> it's unclear. He is going for that little cut. That's a great block. Did that bag fall in or no? No, it's still there. Still there. Joe's got to have one in at least. He got to go up, don't you think? I would think so. Why do you need the back of the hole? It's your bags in the front. Ooh, that's a tough, a tough shot. You use the timeout. Yeah, now's the time. It's 19 to 8. Now Jay's like, so what the heck were you trying to do? He's <laughs> <laughs> like, talk me through that. Tell me what. Oh, the, the crowd's going. Crowd's gone wild. Decision has been made. Game on the line. Bag in hand. Going up. One up top takes two for one. He'll get one point out of that. 19-9. Keeps him alive, most importantly. Jay is off and out of play. 13 to 11 now. Matt Corley and Eddie mm. Greensleeve up over Philip and Alex. That one's not coming back. Well, I say that, but then we've seen some pretty crazy pushes from the side. Uh, I'm willing to bet that one's gone. Oh, made it easy for him. This is the same cut shot we saw earlier in the match. Tanner says go slick side, same angle. Bag is away. And he there hits it, it again. Excellent execution from Jay on those cuts. Going go to the final match here, right? Championship match up next. Ian Cripps and Jareth Nichols making their way to the court. We'll let them go down and back a couple times. We'll take a